The snake den was just the zone that Aggie had picked up. It's gonna be a big figure eight. Right? Hopefully we'll be like cross riders on the way down. Finishing Lillooet, the crew decided to come to Calps. Calps is a little different than kind of everywhere else. Lots of clay, perfect dirt, pretty ideal for digging. So it's a good place to be. Okay, so I have this like, zone. Um, there's this like spot kind of deeper in that um, there's lots of fallen trees and shit, and no one really motos in there so much anymore. And all the moto rocks and like natural like corners and whoops and stuff. Like, Throw a couple of lifts, throw a couple of burns, and we're gonna be laughing. <laughs> Snake Den was just a zone that Aggie had picked out that he'd wanted to ride for a while and took us there. We hiked up, checked it out, and we knew it was gonna be good to go. <laughs> it's always a blast having fresh eyes to come and help me dig and build a new trail. The zone we were digging at was kind of like a, a popular moto zone. Lots of people go out and trail ride and we had our motos with us to do some scouting. We're like, well, why not take a couple hours and go pin it, have fun? It's pretty rad. I haven't ridden my moto in a while, so I was enjoying it. The track just like, I don't know, maybe four or five corners, a couple whoops, a little couple jumps. Super loose and zesty and uh, took me down a couple times. <laughs> I've gone down three times. Eggie had a few little bales here and there. He had some whiskey throttle, and then uh, I think I uh, got a bit of his luck, and I was coming into a corner and just stuffed it, and he ran right over me. Sorry, bud. We all made it out laughing, and it was all good. We're just gonna mosey over to the other zone. Yeah, let's do it. Get some more two wheel action going. Some bicycle action? Yeah. We we're kinda checking out the weather and it wasn't looking so good. It was just rain and the forecast and we were a bit concerned. And the zone was really sandy, so all the raindrops just absorb into the ground. They don't really come up here too much anymore because of all the pine beetle, all these dead trees are all falling everywhere and it's kind of like a blessing in disguise for us because then we can just buck up all those dead logs and you know put features together in no time and the lands are already there. It's a pretty ideal spot, to be honest. <laughs> Big crew of us just hammered it out, building a bunch of berms, jumps, everything. We just yeah. enhanced the trail. It's gonna be a big figure eight around uh, two trees. So hopefully we'll be like cross riders on the way down. Keep it playful and fun, kind of slalom style. This is gonna be really fun to ride. Got so much done in five, six hours, we basically built a whole trail and we basically just finished up now and it's pretty sick. We called it a uh, you know, snake den because there's all these little snake holes everywhere. Repeat tomorrow. Yeah. With bikes. With bikes. Next day, I came back to shoot and it was good to go. Oh. Just a couple of lips I got washed out from yesterday. It's looking good. It's looking way drier than yesterday. It could be fun to give it a shot. Everyone's here, stoked, ready. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, boys. yeah, boys. Yeah. Yeah.
trail is so fun. And it's like being on a rail the whole time. The ruts are established and you just hook up into them. <laughs> Thick out there. It's drifty. Fresh dirt. Are you? Uh, your shoulder. Shoulder? Oh, oh. shoulder. Good thing I had this guy in. Yeah. He went like oh, a... that was fucking scary, dude. Yeah, that was gnarly. I that's my fault. Yeah, that's a... Digging's taking a, a toll on us. Big guy, I love it pretty all right though. Could have been worse. See Brandon come back and be healing up and feeling confident on his bike again and then to crash and then have that little bit of stress on the shoulder again and not really know what's going on. Not really good to see. Shoulder's a bit sore, which I'm a little bit bummed about, but it's the way she goes sometimes. Tame little snake just got so vicious and started biting <laughs> everyone. <laughs> It takes a lot out of you being on the road. You get exhausted. By the last few days, everyone's winding down and, and getting pretty hungry to go home. It started out just great. Yeah. And then it got real like, serious real quick. Brand's a little tweaked, but hopefully he'll be back on the saddle right away. I got my car fixed. I figured, why not? Let's just go for a rip and just ride my bike after 10 weeks of my shoulder giving me grief. 